Hey guys, it's Ash here, and welcome back to another episode of the Perfect Sim Challenge. So, <clears throat> I apologize for that. We just have, oh god, I'm forgetting her name, Rose. I don't know why I forgot her name. I, I've been playing too much 100 Baby Challenge, so I do apologize for that. <laughs> but that part's done. Um, so yes, this is a pre-recording episode of pretty much for the next few month, uh, next few episodes, actually. Um, it's, yeah, pre-records and stuff. Um, she needs to do her homework. Um, yeah, so, yeah, it's a pre-recording episode, or, well, I am going to be Japan in Japan for pretty much a month. Yeah, pretty much a month. So the entire month of May is going to be, like, weird. I apologize <laughs> for that. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to try to spit out as many Perfect Sim videos as I can for this month. We'll see. I think I'm going to hit the end where I'm not going to be able to like post enough or have enough work time to finish everything. So that it's a bit of an eek, um, to be honest, when it comes to that, because like, ugh. Eek. Um, because I'm probably not going to be able to finish my- oh, she just came back from work. I'm not going to be able to finish doing speed builds. So that's the only thing so far. I got to finish voiceovering a lot of my creative sims. I got to create one more sim and then voice over one more speed build and then film the rest of the perfect sim challenge. But, you know, we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Um, so yeah, I just got Rose doing her extra credit homework. I really want her to do well in school. Um, so, still, like, on top of everything else. Um, I think after that, though, it's pretty late at night. Her social need is actually kind of low, so we actually kind of need to deal with that. Um, but we can go to the little night bar, or disco bar I have in the house, in this area. And, um, we can, you know, go make a party and hang out some over there. Um, yeah. Yeah, the nightclub. Oh god, we have so many friends. It's kind of, oof. And we gotta make more friends, too. Like, it's gonna be interesting. Um, very interesting. I still want to become close friends with Malcolm. I think that was my last episode, was making good friends, trying to become at least sort of friendly with Malcolm. Come just start dancing and people will show up. Like, yeah, we have some party at Putia, Putia, Parhudias. I haven't met you. Do a cheerful introduction. And I've met you. Um, but yeah, I gotta make, you know, 20 friends. I also gotta get a BFF. Um, I don't know who I want to be my BFF. I'm, I'm still kind of in the, uh, I don't know. Um... She said she said should socialize with people. Um, go flatter, caddy. Tell a funny story. Uh, brighten day. Do a cheerful introduction to this human. Oh, is that? Oh, that's wow. He's actually Diego. Is actually here. Brighton Day. Yeah, we honestly, I think it's all in a level of, you know, just going and meeting people. Um, also, I think we could do rewards. We should do one reward or something. Eventually, we're probably going to have every reward. Um, we also need to eventually, we also got to eventually save for a potion of youth, but we don't really, you know, don't really need that right now. Um, I don't really need that. Connections? Maybe connections might be a good idea? 
We could do connections. I love the idea of Shameless. Um, the free services is really good. Um, let's do Night Owl. Because she's more likely, you know, to build skill at night. Friendly, compliment outfit, friendly, bright and day, share ideas, get to know. This is- that's Diego, okay. Good flatter, talk about cooking. It just, you know, it gets him in the friend relationship area. Because there's a few people here that are not in the friend area that we can, you know, try to befriend. Get to know, share ideas, talk about handiness. Let's get about day, day, yeah, hot headed, tell a dramatic story. You know, all those fun things. And plus, like, I feel like doing this while dancing is also one of those deals. Um. Because I feel like it like raises your friendship level a little bit more. I don't know. Cart felt compliment. Uh, friendly. Discuss interests. Are you considered a friend now? Yeah, he is. Cool. Jade, how are you doing, my girl? Tell a joke about penguins. Brighten day. Look at her dancing skills. Compliment outfit. Discuss interests. Uh, get to know, I guess. Uh, let's see here. Do game strategy, possibly. You know, just gotta get him in the friend level. Knock knock joke. Oh wait, wait, no, don't tell Urban Legend. That's uh, flatter. We can just flatter her. Um, deep conversation. Friendly. Give her pair tips. Ooh, she's embarrassed. Self-deprecating joke. Awkward encounter. Ooh. Oh, she's she's there that now though. Um, you I think are in friend level. You're friend level actually. Yeah. You are not. Go ask about day. Go get to know. We can cut out that. Uh, show selfie. Heartful compliment. Airhorn? That's a new one. Uh, flatter. Share ideas. He's a snob, but you know. Brighten day. Make funny faces. I don't know. You know Brighten day again. Because that, like, increases charisma. Deep conversation. The queen is full. She's kind of tired. Oops. I, I didn't mean to pause that. Ask about day. Flatter. Uh, I know this is like kind of boring, but you know, we're kind of we're meeting people and getting to know them. Um, and we still have like a small uh, friend group. I just, you know, gotta become friendly with a lot of people. Flatter again. I don't know. I feel like that's kind of like 
a um You know, it's kind of one of those, like, flirting things, but we'll see. Tell a joke about aliens. Come on, Rose. You can do it. I have faith in you. It's also, like, 2 a.m. She should- Oh, Brent! Am I friends with Brent? I know him. Okay. Well. Derp. Um, I think I have friends with every team, though. Um, besides Malcolm. I think. I think I'm friends with everyone but Malcolm. Yeah, because I'm friends with Cassandra. Oh, shoot. That's my phone. Okay. Sorry. Um, I'm friends- you're not a teen. You're a young adult. But I'm fr I, I don't know who I want to be my best friend. I, I really like the idea of Cassandra. But I also love the idea of Yuki. So I'm kind of in a small debate. Oh, I should need to go talk to- I need to talk to Alexander some more. I really want to like get to know the Goss. I really want to become good friends with the Goss. I might go over to their house. We might do that today. Let's head home. And get, like, her needs and stuff back up. And then possibly go over to the Goths. Because it's... Oh, that's the wrong apartment complex. Because it's Saturday. So, like, you know. We still have some time. And... Yeah. As long as, like, I don't know. But I do w really want to become really good friends with, uh, yeah. Is there anything in here? No. I think I'm just going to have her have a quick meal. Let's do a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. But, yeah, I don't know. I'm... But yeah, I really want her to become close to the goths. And then maybe Yuki as like a second best friend. Or a second close friend. Um, you know. Well, we'll, s we'll see. <laughs> I did have a vampire come in the house. I don't know if this was actually recorded or not. But there was a vampire that did come into the house. And um, he did. Sh I think it was she. I think it was Lilith. That came in and uh, sucked up blood. But, you know, we don't have to deal with that. Oh my god, it's 6 a.m. I shouldn't have had her go out late so much last night. She's gonna be like super tired for school tomorrow. It's gonna be so bad. So bad. Okay, thank you. I should probably work on- oh my god, leave me away- leave me, Mora. I swear. I'm about to mute my- uh, oh my god. Mute. Please. Flea market's in town. Oh. Anything over here that would be interesting. That I could snag for a cheap price. That's CC. They put CC up on here. Um, I do like this lamp. Though it's kind of expensive. That's a bit of an eek. Could do a desk lamp. Maybe. Eh. I think we're okay on furniture right now for her. <laughs> um, I'm sleeping. Leave me alone. Um, eh, she's awake. She slept enough. Come. Um, actually, I want you to come and get some food down here. I know it's kind of expensive, but like, let's go haggle. 
We have a high enough charisma. We could probably go and haggle. And she's just gonna go out there on her underwear. That's lovely. I love it. Ooh, 25% off. Nice. Um, let's do pork. Makes me feel good. Is this a- okay, it's not a glitch, it's just, he's wearing, um, jungle adventure gear. I don't know. Hey, teenager! Talk about cooking, bright and day. Share ideas. Tell a dramatic story. Teenager, teenager. <laughs> Makes me happy. And she's just out here in her PJs too. I kind of view her as not having a bra underneath that outfit. So this is kind of like... Kind of an uh, interesting event, you know? So, are you a teen? No, you're my neighbor. What am I doing? He's gotten really skinny recently. Is it just me? Or has he gotten- No, that's not my neighbor. I don't know who he is. Oh, okay. Well, goodbye. Goodbye. That's fine. Whatever. Just finish eating your food, Angela, and we'll go to the, uh, we'll go to the goths. Real quick. And you know, life will be good. Life will be good. Oh, is that the land grab? That's not a land grab. He is! It's Jeffrey Landgrab. Do I know? <gasps> I don't know Jeffrey Landgrab. Do a cheerful introduction to Jeffrey Landgrab. Yeah, outgoing, family oriented, and good. She just ate pork. She finished the meal. Cool. We'll go we'll go hang out at the Goth's house today. Cuz I want to go, you know, hang out at the Goth's. Um though we're getting close to the end of the video. I might just go in there and then end and start the video again at the Goth's house. We'll see. Um It's it's an interesting entertaining little event I guess but, um, yeah but I think yeah the next goal for the next episode will be becoming uh, best friends with Cassandra Goth just getting there and becoming good friends with everyone in the Goth family I kind of like want to see like the Goths coming in and taking you know them under them under her wing You know? Like, Cassandra was here when things were a little rough. And I feel like Cassandra would have, you know, she would have her take her under her wing, wing and, take care, and take care of her son. Here. Alex. Alex. My future husband, come here. I really want to marry Alex. I, I, I know I'm going to have to age him up and stuff, but... Yeah. Um, Bella's here. Have I met Bella? I haven't met Bella yet. Okay. Well, I'm sorry guys. I'm going to go introduce myself to your mother, Cassandra. And I don't know where Mortimer is. I don't think Mortimer is anywhere around. Which is kind of sad, but you know. I love Bella. For a while I hated her because she was, you know, just this cl they're just this classic like we're kind of rich, we're we're a party place. 
Oh, Alex. You know. But yeah, I think we'll end this off here. I want to try to get get best friends with Cassandra in the next episode and everything. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe and all that other fun stuff. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.